Hey guys, um, it's Brandon. Uh, I'm making this video to tell you exactly how you can have an OBE, maintain an OBE, stay in it when you're having an OBE, um, and then how you can control an OBE. If you don't know what an OBE is, it's kind of like a lucid dream, a dream where you know you're dreaming, except it's, OBE means out of body experience. It's also called OOBE. Uh, out of body experience. Um, it's basically when when you where when you fall asleep, you're aware that of when you fall asleep, and you come out of your body, and you travel through space. Um, so, first things first, I'm going to explain to you how to have an OB. So you can get out a pen and paper if you want. Pause this video. But um, so basically, you're gonna want to go to sleep, and you're gonna want to sleep for about five hours. After about five hours of sleeping, wake up. You'll be really tired and just stay awake for like ten, fifteen minutes. Get some water, go to the bathroom or something. And then uh, just lay back down and lay still. D just lay still. If you sleep for about five hours, you should be right out. But the, the thing is, is you want to lay still. Very completely still. And if you do this, your body will start to fall asleep. But this isn't the only thing you need to do. You need to stay awake mentally so how to do that is you want to meditate maybe even pick up a meditation practice if you don't if you haven't already we in the breathing practice that I recommend to stay awake keep your mind awake when you're letting your body fall asleep is watch the breath in out in out. and it's as simple as that uh, but what's going to happen while you, when you're doing that? You want to keep your eyes closed. And you want your intention to be to have an OBE. Not just go back to sleep. So what's going to happen is the sounds in the room, like if you have a fan going, it's going to go, like it might sound like this. Shh. But when you're falling asleep, it might go, shh. Like that. And you might... And you might hear voices talking. You might hear uh, like rats running around. Uh, this weird things you'll hear. Uh, and you'll start getting these hallucinations. And what you want to do now is you want to pray. You want to pray um, to your higher power. And if you don't have a higher power, God, I recommend you get one. And just pray to your higher power. And ask your higher power. to take you out of your body when you're in that state of hallucinations and stuff and what's going to happen is you're going to either roll out or you're going to climb out you're going to stand up out or you're going to fall out and uh, of your body and when, when that happens you're having an out of body experience now from this point you want to know how to maintain it. So how you maintain an OBE. And this is going from my own experience. Out of body experiences. Is you, you will feel. Your eyes in reality. You will feel your physical eyes. Closed. And when, you're, when you're in the OBE. But yet your eyes will be open. In another world. So what you want to do. Is you want to keep your physical eyes closed. Because you will feel them. I don't know why the hell this is. Weird shit. But just keep your physical eyes closed. You'll, you'll, you will feel your physical eyes closed. As if like. You're still awake. But at the same time you're dreaming. Just keep your physical eyes closed. Keep them closed. That's all you have to do. If you do that. You'll maintain your OBE for as long as you possibly can. Because once you open your eyes. You start taking in physical reality. And you're going to wake up.
And then from that point, you're maintaining it, you're in an out-of-body experience, you want to know how to control it. So to control it, the way you can control the way you can the way you control an OBE is you think. You think like like right now, awake. Think in your head like something like what's for dinner tonight? Well think that. Alright. Now in the OBE when you think a word, like when you think about a sentence, that will be your voice. This is where I learned from experience uh, with it. The think, you think the OBE into existence. You think about something. And when you're in that OBE realm, you can pray. Another way, that's one way. But another way is to pray in the OBE to your higher power for something to appear, like your, your dream girlfriend or your dream boyfriend. You, you know, and you can make out with him, kiss him. And yeah, and that's that's the video. I hope you enjoyed. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Bye.